Can you tell us a bit about your planet? Yes. To I'm a blue. I I think I've done this before. I'm about five foot two. I'm I'm blue. I have one of uh, one uh, big toe and three little toes, and one thumb and three little fingers. I'm sort of bulbous looking, sort of like a gingerbread man. <laughs> I, uh, but I like that look. I really, really, my women are all. But I. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky you. Yes. But any, what was I? Ah, uh, the planet, the most civilization. Oh, yeah. You have several trillions of you made it, right? You made me think something else. <laughs> okay. And I glide. In my society, I'm a glider. They choose, some choose to walk, some choose to run or sit. But I am permitted to glide. That is... A, a privilege that I have gained. I'm allowed to speak to Earth, and that is a privilege that I've gained through. Our planet is a, a planet of, um, we move up from level to level of uh, learning. That's how we, uh, that's how we move as a planet. There's a belt around the middle of our planets, there's four of them, that actually keeps the planet moving and all the different things in place in our cultures. And once we finished a level of that, say we wanted to be a nanobiologist or a quark specialist, we then have to spend 100 days helping the planet live. And this gives us time to reevaluate what our next job will be and give us appreciation for the fact that we don't have to work every day. We just have to work that 100 days after we achieve a level. It's, and then we can think about what we want to do for the next level. So. It's really quite a wonderful thing. And then when you achieve a level, we have celebrations. There's always celebrations on our planet, always. It's a wonderful thing. We have, a, when a child is born, there's a celebration. When someone achieves a level, there's a celebration. When they have a quick day, that would be their birthday. Then we have a celebration. When their org level is at seven, then we have a celebration. Um, an org level is your vibrational level, by the way. Uh, whenever they attain certain things, certain levels, we have celebrations. And it's a wonderful place to be. And that's why we're so interested in Earth, is you have some wonderful things that happen here. Very wonderful. We like your celebrations. We like your intensity of emotion. We like that your thought processes are muddled. I love that. Because they're not something that you can just say, I know they're going to do this today because I don't know that. There are a few of you that are creatures of habit, but still, you go outside that now and then. And, right? I mean, I was watching this one human and every day for 26 days they did exactly the same thing. On the 27th day, they did something totally different. <laughs> I was totally going, why? <laughs> why? Why did you do something totally different when you did something the very same way for all that time? I don't know. See, that's why you're interesting. I like that. So then I'll find out later why. But I found out why, you know. Ah. <sighs> Oh, okay, I'm realizing now. <laughs> okay. Do you experience emotion? Yes, but not in the intensity that you do. Your, your emotional intensity is probably at least three times greater. And that's why oh, I try to experience everything through the body when I'm in the body. There are 
are things they won't let me experience, but I'll get there someday. <laughs> I will. I'm determined. But, yes. How, how do you reproduce? We reproduce like very reproduce? similarly to the way you reproduce, except without the noise. What <laughs> noise? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Well, there is noise, but it's not like what you make. I, I thought, I thought some of you were dying. I was ready to resuscitate, but no, I'm not allowed to do that. 